What a look this is to the people that are watching this debate. I'll give way one more time before I make progress. He's been he's incredibly kind in giving way, particularly on this, <laughs> particularly on this, on this subject. Uh, I just wondered if you might take the opportunity to update us on the missing donations yeah. and, the, that, that, um, and the fraud investigation into the First Minister's husband, the, your party's chief executive. Oh. Order. Don't shout at the right honourable gentleman. We all have to hear his answer, and while I'm on my feet, I'd be grateful if the honourable gentleman who has just intervened would in future uh, use the word he, not you, when he's referring to, um, to the party opposite him. Mr Blackford. Madam Deputy Speaker, let me respectfully say to members opposite that all monies that are raised by the Scottish National Party for the purposes of fighting an independence campaign, I will give you a guarantee, I will give you a promise, I will give you a commitment right here and now, that every penny which is raised will be spent on independence campaigning, because that's what we are about. And there's a big difference, there's a big difference to those that fund the SNP and fund the independence campaign, because I'll give you another promise. Not one single member of the SNP that gives to us willingly will end up in the House of Commons. What they will be doing is they will be funding they will be funding the SNP and the independence movement to make sure that we deliver on our promise of taking Scotland out of this yeah, union. Yeah, yeah, yeah.